Latavia. Yes, yeah, some whispers. Yeah, yes. My nurse Mimi, yeah. My secretary. No, I didn't get it last night. I got it kind of like early this morning. Yeah, Richard, why you say that? Stop crying. I rushed right over her. I, I have, I heard about what happened. I just got bits and pieces of it. I didn't get the whole story. Right. Well, this is what I heard. I heard it was five of y'all that was going to Mexico. You, you was gonna go get a, a tummy tuck. You got six kids, right? I know you're trying to get everything back right for the summer. And they say that y'all came over there and the cartel thought y'all was over there. I don't, I didn't get the full. All right, okay, so, so far I'm right. Okay, and they say that they, I don't know, we just seen them just throwing people. <laughs> it looked like they just throwing y'all in the back of a truck. And I said, they said, it was four of y'all went over there, but only two of y'all made it back. Right. Man, golly, your eyes are swollen shut. Oh my God, look at your eyes, the pain that you done. I can imagine. I can only imagine what you done went through. You say you needed somebody to talk to. Well, I tell you what, Latavia Washington McGee, I'm the, listen to me. Everybody called me. Who, to, who told you about me? Oh, for real? Ah, oh, that's all right. <clears throat> that's all right, right there. Well, I tell you what, don't, don't never mention that name because that's that's don't don't mention that name. Can't nobody know that's the person that yeah, that's my connection to everybody. So don't you tell nobody that person name. And they told you to call me. So I want you to tell me what happened. Y'all renting a minivan, right? Now, who was these other people that came down to Mexico? Well, yeah, the, 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 it was three other, it was three guys, right? Right. Mm. Man, rest in peace to both of them black kings. I seen the video, y'all was just headed down there, you know. But let, let me ask you a question before you go forward. All three of them boys that was going along the two, they lost a life, and the other one they shot in the leg, all three of them got like, all three of them got drug convictions on their records, right? How do I know that? Now, nah, listen, you got your information, and I got my way to get my information. So you and three guys that have previous drug records in a rental van with you on your way to the drug capital of the United States, to Mexico. I, I know I'm not trying to say that's what it is. I'm just trying to say you are in a van with three guys that have been had major drug conventions allegedly and y'all going to Mexico for you to get a tummy tuck? All right, go ahead. I'm listening. <clears throat> when y'all crossed over that Right, y'all start noticing y'all was being followed. Okay, go ahead. The 
<laughs> they what? They, they they threw the spikes in front of y'all tires. Y'all, the minivan turned over with y'all in it. What happened? They got out and started running. Oh my God, here. That's not up out of there. All right, it's just a little piece of tissue. I just gave you a little bit of piece of tissue. Right. And you, you, you feel like talking, okay? You sit there and watch them. God. You serious. Right. Riddle their bodies with bullets. God. Man. I know you ain't never seen the human flesh ripped off the bones like that. They pulled him out and shot him in the legs and what they do to you. That's when they grabbed you and threw y'all in the back. Right. And that's all you remember. And next thing you know, you they they gave you something to knock you out so you can't remember. <laughs> man, they gave you something to knock you out. You acting like this man in black where he waved that little thing and they don't remember nothing. Now, you're not going to tell me. Oh, man, get out of here with that. Well, you know what I'm saying. You need to stop. Now, I understand that you write what you're saying, but I'm telling you right now, it's just something about your story that don't make sense. Like, <laughs> you a mother of six and you going over there to get a tummy tuck. Ain't no mama of six can afford no tummy tuck. Now, you, you, you need to stop. You need to stop right now. And you need to tell the truth allegedly. You, you think I'm crazy. You know how long I've been doing this? For a long time, and I know when somebody's standing in front of me lying to me, I'm licking, I, I can hear it in your voice. You lying to me. Tell me what you lying about. Everything. You are lying because look here. You know y'all went down to Mexico to go pick them bricks up. Them boys right there. See, look at you done dropped your head. Them boys right there is ex-drug dealers turned into new drug dealers, a body bag drug dealer. They gone. Them boys got tags on their toe. They bodies are stinky, boy. Can you? But the, I know it smell. They bodies are stinking all the way from Mexico to the United States of America. Y'all. Yes, y'all did. Y'all went there. That was, that was a drug deal. Went bad, and you know it went bad. Yeah, and that fifth person, see, that fifth person, see, they already knew. They didn't want me. Oh, y'all riding over there to Mexico in a van. See, y'all want smart. Y'all didn't go in three different vehicles where y'all got a car in the front and one in the back and the one in the front go. And then when they see the police or the cartel or somebody get behind them, they just take off. And then, you know, the one in the middle that got the door. Y'all didn't do that. See, y'all didn't understand the assignment. You ain't got to tell me. And that's how it went. I'm telling you that's how it went. I know that's how it went. Don't you know? Don't you know I got connections over there with the cartel? I know everybody. 
Why you think they call me whispers? Because my voice, when I talk like this, my voice carry weight. It's so powerful. People all across the world know who I am. I'm telling you, I already talked to them people over there in Mexico. And they told me y'all went over there to get them bricks. And this ain't the first time y'all went over there. You can't even stop crying. You went over there to get a tummy tuck, man. I, and you know what? A lot of people going to believe that. A lot of people going to buy that story. But I'm not buying that story. Them boys, is they done lost their life over here trying to get them bricks. You already know they got the wall up. See, that's why I say y'all think y'all can do what y'all want to do over here in the United States. See, Brittany Griner thought that, but when y'all get over there in these other countries, you already look at that girl that went over there in Mexico and her friends took her life. You, come on, man. And y'all think y'all just going to go over there? Y'all can't go over there and mess with them people. You already know Chico and Chavez and them. They ain't playing. See, y'all thought it was a game. Now, I'm going to ask you again. Now, you listen to me. Now, I'm going to ask you some real simple questions. And I want some real simple answers. You say, y'all in Mexico at 11.45, right? Why when your cell phone was picked up from the side of the road and the battery had crushed, why did it have 1230 on there? <laughs> See there? <laughs> you know you done messed up. We didn't find no cell phone on the side of the road. See, I just want to see. See, you see what I'm saying? Just stay quick. I I didn't say you didn't have a cell phone, but we didn't find, they nobody find no cell phone. I just said that, cause you said, yeah, it was 11. We ain't found no cell phone. I just said that, cause I wanted to see what you was gonna say. Now look at you, you done put up here. You done almost, how you gonna leave them six kids out here with no mama? You out here with no mama, I could tell you ain't got no man. You ain't with, cause ain't no man gonna let his woman or his wife go nowhere with three other men like that unless they finna go around and train on. Oh, ain't no way in the world your man gonna, you gonna, ain't man, no way my woman gonna convince me she going to Mexico with three other men. Now, now, see, I knew what I knew when I said that about that cell phone. And Leslie, you was going to come through. I knew you was going to come through with the truth. And y'all went over there to get them bricks. You told me you're going to have a tummy tuck. And them folks over there, man, they weren't playing with y'all. Yes. No, no. I don't know. I don't. You ain't got to tell me what happened. I just want to know the truth. You ain't gotta go now. Now, matter of fact, I don't even. I, I don't even want to. I don't even want to know <laughs> no more information. I just knew. Go ahead. Can you tell me something that I won't tell nobody? You're gonna tell me what you want to tell me. I ain't gonna tell nobody. No, <laughs> I ain't got no wire. Wait, I ain't got no wire. I ain't got. I ain't got no wire on. Go on, tell me what you want to tell me. Fake money. <laughs> you think... Why would y'all go over there with... Them boys been dealing with them. Them boys been doing this for a long time. You didn't know... So last time y'all came over there, y'all left fake money. And y'all had the audacity to go back over there after y'all disrespected them like that. Man, look, I, I just, I, you asked for me to come. My secretary, Nurse Mimi, she told me to come see you. I, 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 I look, I got a lot of, you talking about don't leave you. <laughs> Man, 
You already left your own self. You already left your kids. You left everybody. Yes, you did over there. You almost lost your 